Good morning. Welcome to 49ers in 5, your daily update on everything happening with the team that you need to know. I'm Rob Stats Carrera. Today is Monday, April 15th, 2024. Happy Tax Day, everybody. Here's what's happening with your San Francisco 49ers. Over the weekend, the Brandon IU contract negotiations continued to swirl. First, we got reports online that IU either had already or was about to formally request a trade from the San Francisco 49ers. Then on Sunday, IU's agent Ryan Williams shut those rumors down immediately, quote tweeting one of the people spreading them and saying, you need better sources. I thought this was interesting for a couple of different reasons. First, the fact that his agent would go out of his way to shut down this talk is kind of surprising, right? You would think it would be to his benefit if people thought that Ayuk was upset and was putting pressure on the 49ers to get a deal done, but that's not what happened. Instead, he immediately squashed any possibility of Ayuk requesting a trade, at least to this point. And I think part of the reason why, if you don't know, is that Williams and John Lynch are very, very close. They have a relationship that goes all the way back to when Lynch himself was a player in the NFL. So maybe that relationship with John Lynch is what compelled Ryan Williams to actually step up and address those rumors. And look, maybe both sides figure it's better for everybody involved if no one thinks this gets contentious. We don't want the 49ers thinking it gets contentious. We want everything to stay on the up and up and Maybe that's a good sign. I don't know. Maybe tomorrow Ayuk does formally request a trade, right? That's not off the table either. But at least right now to this point, things don't seem to be maybe as contentious as they were when the 49ers were negotiating with, say, Debo Samuel, who also formally requested a trade a little before the NFL draft when he was trying to get his big money. So at least for now, Everything seems to be okay between the 49ers and Brandon Ayuk as they continue to work towards a deal. We always give you one thing to read, one thing to watch, and one thing you might have missed. One thing to read on this Monday, quite possibly the dumbest thing ever written about Brock Purdy. It comes to us from the NFL Analysis Network, and it features the anonymous quotes of an NFL executive who says he wants to see one more thing out of Brock Purdy this coming season. And it's dumb because if you've ever seen Brock Purdy play, you basically see what he's asking for all the damn time. If you want to read the article, click the link in the description of this episode. One thing to watch, Caitlin Clark was a guest on SNL over the weekend. I thought it was a pretty cool skit. She stopped by just for a little bit, but she got a couple good zingers in there. It's worth your time. Not going to take a bunch of your time. Again, link description episode. One thing you may have missed, we're all kind of anticipating what could happen with the new kick return rules, right? I've said many times I want to see Debo back there or McCaffrey, a star player, because I think there's a chance to make plays. Well, apparently Micah Parsons has the same idea, except he doesn't want to be on the kickoff coverage team. He wants to be the kick returner, and he's gone so far as to lobby the Cowboys and their special teams coach, John Fossil, for that opportunity. Now, Fossil did say on the Ross Tucker Football Podcast, that is probably not going to happen. And it's a decision that's higher up on the pay scale than what he's currently making. It would be really fun to see Micah Parsons return kicks, but uh, yeah, can't see the Cowboys making that a reality. Although who the hell knows with the way they've been making decisions this off season. That's a wrap on today's 49ers and five, please rate review and follow the gold standard podcast network, like, and subscribe to our YouTube channel. If you click the bell, You'll get notified every single time we go live, which is every single weekday for you. Today, I'll be live with Vish Kumaran. You don't want to miss that. We'll talk about the IU stuff, why the agent refuted it. We'll get into all of it. Please, please, please join us for that. Enjoy your Monday, everybody. I'm Rob Stats Guerrero. We'll talk later today.